Welcome back. Time now is 616. Hope you're having a really nice start to your Sunday morning. Here's a look at the cloud cover out there making for kind of a gloomy sunrise, but a beautiful one at that. We are going to stick around with some clouds throughout the rest of your day today as temperatures has hit the low 40s this morning. If you're waking up in Indian Springs, you're waking up to freezing conditions, 48 in Death Valley and 38 for Pahrump. Today's daytime high hitting 58 degrees, so we're actually warmer than what we saw yesterday afternoon. We're staying mostly dry today with wind speeds staying nice and light as well. Only chance of seeing some precipitation could be some light snow moving through our local mountains later on this afternoon and evening. But here in the valley, not a lot of weather worries there. We're looking at upper 50s hitting by around 2 o'clock and sticking around through the afternoon as those wind speeds stay around 6 miles per hour. Tonight we tumble back into the low 50s by 8 o'clock and upper 40s by around 9 p.m. Overall, really quiet and a pretty typical January day for us. Partly cloudy skies coming from this system. The atmosphere Atmospheric River continues to pummel California with more rain and high elevation snow. Today's snowfall is going to be a major concern moving through the Sierras, possible for the White Mountains as well. Closer to home, we're going to see mostly dry conditions today. We're not going to see the system quite reach us, but another one is headed towards California by Sunday into Monday. This is expected to actually push east and bring some rain and snow to southern Nevada as well as northern Nevada. So we're expecting timing wise for that to be hitting the early morning hours of Monday for some areas, but I think more likely and more impactful Monday night into the rest of Tuesday. So by early Tuesday morning, taking a look at some rainfall totals and what we could see for Las Vegas. Of course, California taking the brunt of this storm when they're already inundated with some problems from that uh, with the infrastructure. We could see just under two tenths of an inch for Las Vegas. Watching that closely, they have a flood watch for throughout the West Coast, and we also have a winter storm watch for our local mountains from this system. It'll be in place Monday night through Tuesday night with anywhere from six to 12 inches of snow possible for sheep range and uh, spring mountains above 7,000 feet. Here's a look at the next seven days. We're staying consistent with our temperatures, but as we watch for snow by tomorrow into Tuesday, we're watching for plenty of rain Monday, Tuesday, and possibly into Wednesday morning as well. A brief break Thursday, Friday before more unsettled weather could head our way, Rachel, by next Saturday.